Every time astronomers peer through their telescopes, there's the possibility of discovering something new. Something that's never been seen before, that either confirms a long-held theory, or completely rewrites the future of science and space exploration. It's invariably described as a difficult job, perhaps a somewhat repetitive pastime, but an exciting one as well, because you just never know what you're going to see next. This is Unveiled, and today we're answering the extraordinary question, did scientists just discover a giant planet that should not exist? Do you need the big questions answered? Are you constantly curious? Then why not subscribe to Unveiled for more clips like this one, and ring the bell for more thought-provoking content. The business of exoplanets is booming these days. Yes, at the time of writing, we're still at less than 5,000 of them officially confirmed. But scientists are certain that there are many, many more out there. And it seems that new exoplanet candidates are being discovered on a daily basis. Every so often, though, one comes along that just doesn't fit with all that have gone before it. And that's what has happened with the discovery of B Centauri B. Situated in the B Centauri two-star system, some 325 light-years away from Earth, the planet B Centauri B is surviving under seemingly impossible conditions, leading many to claim that it should not exist. The two-star system has a mass at least six times greater than the Earth's sun, and just the main star, a B-type star, is said to be at least three times as hot as our sun is. Up until now, scientists had debated whether planets could exist in a setup such as this, and no planet had ever been discovered orbiting a star that's more than three times the mass of the Sun. So B Centauri B is already a record breaker, but the strangeness of this particular alien world goes further. In terms of solar system planets, it has been much more readily compared to Jupiter rather than Earth. It's said to be around 11 times more massive than Jupiter is, making the star to planet mass ratio about the same in the B Centauri system as it is for Jupiter in the solar system. However, the planet B Centauri B orbits much further out, at a distance more than 100 times what Jupiter does. At this early stage, scientists believe that this may be what has allowed it to survive, because if it were any closer to its two-star center, then it would surely burn up, disintegrate, and perish. Interestingly, though, the B Centauri B orbit, as far out as it is, is also reportedly quite circular. This isn't the case in the solar system, where planets carve an elliptical path around the Sun instead. This part of the story is particularly tricky to square up, but there is an early suggestion that it may have been influenced by B Centauri B at one time arriving at its current location from somewhere else. Indeed, those behind its discovery have commented that, quote, the planet is unlikely to have formed in situ, but might have formed elsewhere, end quote. One possibility, then, could be that it was a rogue world cutting through the galaxy in ancient times before it was captured by the two-star anchor that guides it today. Its discovery is thanks to a team working at the European Southern Observatory's Very Large Telescope in Chile's Atacama Desert. The planet was found via direct imaging, using the facility's Spectro-Polarometric High Contrast Exoplanet Research Instrument, otherwise known as SPHERE, as part of a more than two-year survey ending in April 2021. The study's lead author, Marcus Jainson, has described the finding of B Centauri B as very exciting, explaining that it, quote, completely changes the picture about massive stars as planet hosts, end quote. Before B Centauri B, it might have seemed pointless to look at massive systems like B Centauri with the hope of finding planets, but now we know that it isn't. So where do we go from here? In the case of this particular planet, at only 325 light years away from Earth, it's nowhere near as distant as so many of the other stars and planets we've discovered to date. That's not to say that we'll be visiting anytime soon, as we're still far from the technology needed to get us there in even a half manageable time frame. But we should be able to study it with clarity and confidence. And we already know that B Centauri B has done its part to rewrite the rulebook on exoplanet hunting so it's sure to influence countless more surveys and studies in the coming years. It's worth remembering, too, that this isn't the first newly discovered planet to be labeled as something that should not exist. Back in September 2019, for example, another planet was granted the same dubious descriptor, the faraway gas giant GJ3512b. This was again considered a massive world, although it's nowhere near as massive as B Centauri b, it should be noted, coming in at roughly half the mass of Jupiter. It does have a wider diameter than Jupiter, though, so references to it being a giant are more than fair. What truly sets GJ3512b apart, though, is again the nature of the star that it orbits. Only this time the star is very small instead of very big, 
We're talking here about the red dwarf known as Gliese 3512, which is just 31 light years away from us and has a mass that's only around one eighth that of our sun. Up until the 2019 discovery, scientists had suspected that only smaller planets could orbit smaller stars. Earth-sized planets were perhaps slightly bigger, but nothing so big as a world that's half of Jupiter. Since the 2019 discovery, however, our eyes have been open to the possibility and indeed the reality that larger worlds are out there. And now something similar is happening again with B Centauri B. We know that one of the most prominent drives in all of astronomy, from a mainstream news point of view at least, is the search for Earth-like worlds. For much of the 2010s, it was the Kepler Space Telescope that was fueling so many of the headlines, as super-Earths and second-Earths seemingly presented themselves all across the galaxy. But as we move through the 2020s, perhaps the emphasis is changing, and scientists are fully embracing the weirder planets in the universe. We're discovering worlds that don't fit with our best predictions and models, and that's prompting everyone, astronomers, cosmologists, anyone with even a passing interest in space, to adapt their understanding. Nowadays, too, while the search for Earth-like worlds is still very much in full swing, we're looking at other star systems and asking, what's possible? It's clearer than ever before that our solar system is just one way of doing things. It's a well-balanced setup that works particularly well for us, allowing as it does for life on our planet. But in a universe of infinite variations, what else is out there? The likes of B Centauri b and GJ 3512b have caught us by surprise and they have been widely labeled as places that should not exist. But that idea is already outdated. We of course know that they do exist, and therefore it's perhaps a reasonable suggestion that there should be many more planets just like them. And it truly is a case of watch this space. With major missions, including the James Webb Space Telescope, set to generate endless streams of data over the coming years, we could well find ourselves inundated with new exoplanets to study before long. What's more, there are various concept missions in the pipeline too, including the Habitable Exoplanet Observatory, or HABEX mission. This is a proposed NASA project that, if the agency goes ahead with it, will specifically seek out habitable worlds based on a wide number of variables. Someday in the future then, the HABEX or something similar could operate as our first point of call whenever we're sizing up another planet for human life that isn't Earth. What's clear is that discoveries such as that of B Centauri b offer a vital contribution to our progress in space. This faraway Jupiter-like world, flagged up on a telescope in the Chilean desert in the 21st century, has prompted astronomers all over the world to take note. Here we have a new type of planet, a world we've never seen before, and something that was once deemed impossible made possible. And that's why scientists have discovered a giant planet that's cause for celebration. But it can't be something that should not exist, because now we know that it does. What do you think? Is there anything we missed? Let us know in the comments, check out these other clips from Unveiled, and make sure you subscribe and ring the bell for our latest content.